Subscribe to our YouTube channel to become a part of our growing YouTube community and to learn English effectively. Can't you delay your return a little bit? No, I can't. I've really got important business. Keep in touch then, okay? Okay. Well, you know what? Don't do it, cause the minute you do, they lose all respect for you. Well, it's not like that. We just email, it's really nothing. On top of which I am definitely thinking about stopping because it's getting out of hand. Confusing, but not, because it's nothing. Where do you meet him? Oh, listen, I can't even remember. Okay, on my birthday, I wandered into over 30 rooms, for a joke, sort of and he was there, and we started chatting. About what? Oh, books, and music. How much we both love New York. Harmless. Harmless, meaningless. Bouquets of sharpened pencils. Oh. Excuse me? Forget it. We don't talk about anything personal. So I don't know his name or what he does or where he lives exactly. So it'll be really easy for me to stop seeing him, because I'm not. Come back. You haven't paid yet. May, just let him go. But he took some newspaper away without paying. I know. Why? You make me confused. He lives nearby and he would just glance at the newspaper headlines, read the political sections and return them later. Why does he have such a privilege? He used to be a hero during the wartime and everyone respect him. I see. Does he live by himself? Yes. He has no children and his wife passed away when he was in the battle. He must be lonely? I bet. But he is always busy telling the children stories. How respectable. Excuse me. Can you tell me how to get started using these machines? Of course. Are you a new member here? Yes. Welcome. My name is Johnson. Nice to meet you. Do you have any experience using weights? No, I don't. So I need some help. Well, first it is important to go through a good stretch. You must warm up properly so that you don't hurt yourself on the machines. Yes, I know that. Derek just led me through the warm-up in the aerobics room. So I'm ready, I think. I can start using the machines. All right, great. Then we must get a card for you. What do you mean, a membership card? I already have one. No, not that. I mean a training card. The card allows you to keep track of how much weight you use on each machine. Here, let me show you. I'm ready. Now, you can see that on this card there are all the machines listed. So, when you go through the series of 12 machines, you enter in the number of repetitions you do. And you also enter in the weight at which you set the machine. I see. So this card helps me to keep track of my progress. Yes. And it also reminds you what is a suitable weight for each machine. Today, I will go through the machines with you one by one. I will show you how to use them. And we will determine what is a good starting weight for you. All right. Great. So you write your name and member number at the top of the card. And then, after you exercise each time, you file the card here. Great. Why don't we start on the machines? 
Are you all right? Can you do more? I'm sorry. I know there are still seven machines, but I'm exhausted. That's okay. Don't worry. It's important not to push yourself, especially not at the beginning. What can I do though? I don't know the proper settings for the rest of the machines. We can just go through them next time. It's no problem, really. The most important thing is to know your limits. So if you feel burned out now, it is good to stop. Because if you strain a muscle or hurt your back, then you won't be able to exercise for a couple weeks. Right? Yes. I suppose it's best to stop. What's your favorite hobby? I'd like reading books best. What kinds of books do you like to read? Literature and economy. By the way, would you like to see movies? That's okay. What do you do in your spare time? I like to play golf, play badminton or crack jokes. I just like to sleep like a lazy cat. That's a bad habit. I heard Rose is pregnant. I hope it'll be a boy this time. I hope so, too. Rose and her husband have been wanting a boy so much. After three baby girls in a row, Rose is under a lot of pressure from her in-laws. They want a boy in the worst way now. But baby girls are just as good and just as fun as baby boys. I agree with you, but you know how old-fashioned the elders are. How is he? Not very well. He was white about the gills. Did he see the doctor? Yeah, but he refused to take the medicine. Why? I don't know the reason. I have tickets to the Phantom of the Opera on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I'd love to. What time is the show? It's at 8 o'clock. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at 6 o'clock? Uh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the theater before the show, around 7.30. That sounds fine. What happened to that girl you were seeing? Oh, Jackie? We broke up last week. That was a short relationship. You only started dating two months ago. It was actually a long two months. She was a psycho. What do you mean? She would be laughing one moment, and if I said something insensitive, she would start crying. I didn't want to deal with that. She sounds very emotional. She was a psycho, man. One time we were supposed to get together. I was waiting for her call, and when she finally called, she was screaming why I wasn't at her place. Were you supposed to be there? I thought she was going to call when she was done shopping. It was a misunderstanding. She was literally screaming on the phone over this. Okay, you're right. She's a psycho. I'm just glad it's over. What's your little caper? Come home so late. We are all worried about you. Oh, I am terribly sorry. But I was so captivated with the singer at the subway exit. So I forgot the time. Singing? At the subway exit? Oh, it sounds like someone needs some money. Oh, no, the guy was a musician who just sang. 
He played the guitar and sang so many cool pop songs. Many people were drawn to his music and there was no hat on the floor. He sang for appreciation, but not for money. It is just pop song. You could have sung there too if you want it. Oh, no, it was a kind of pop art. I like it, but I couldn't do it that well. Honey, just do it next time. Have you heard of the real art in the subway station in Russia? No, but tell me some. I am interested. Many oil painting exhibitions are there. That is a kind of museum exhibition. Are there many people there? Do you think people actually like them? I am sure you will. There are some works, and some students who major in painting interpret the meaning for visitors. And people can enjoy the paintings while waiting for the train. But I still prefer the pop music in the subway. Both the pop music and the oil painting aid arts, but with different aesthetic values. Dad, you talk well, but can you appreciate that kind of art? Not well enough, but I'm learning. Become our student and get access to effective and free educational materials.